Hey guys! Hey! I'm Emerald. And I'm Catherine. I mean. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We have to. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Now we're straight. Okay, well, um, you can't really <laughs> see my face because I'm blocked by all these. So. All the comments. Hey guys! So I think we may have to like stand. There we go. There we go. We should oh, stand. There. We can oh, wait. stand. I think. Wait, Let's maybe see. if we do. Hold on, wait, wait. Sorry, we're figuring out technical difficulties. Hold on. Oh, wait, I don't think this works. We got this. We got this. Oh, ah! What? We got it. It's all good. It's all good. Okay. Oh, there. That's a little bit. There we go. So it's just, you know. All right. Anyways. <laughs> so. Hey, guys. We are on Periscope live with you guys. Oh, yes, answering weird. all of your questions from Twitter with the hashtag Ask Shadow Hunters. Yes. Yeah, so use the hashtag so we can see what you guys are Oh, okay. Doing. Here's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look. It looks so pretty. Like, all your hearts are Aww. right next to your face. But I get the comments, so I'm better. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. So okay. Hugs from or uh, hi from hi. Kansas. That's oh, awesome. and Switzerland and Brazil and the Philippines. Brazil, Scotland. I'm I'm a little blind. Oh my gosh. Brazil, no, no, you're not. Florida. Florida, Australia, Mexico, Texas. Woo! Toronto, Argentina, Argentina New York City, Bulgaria, Mexico, Canada, Colorado, Puerto Rico. <laughs> okay. We gotta get to these questions now. Okay. Okay, here, Melissa asks, has there ever been a time in the show that you almost cried while filming? Do you wanna take that? Yes. Well, I, there were several, but like really cried because we emotionally felt weird or because, see that's a weird question. That is a weird or question. because your scene had to do with crying. Uh, it both with me. Actually, the, the, the scene that we're doing today, there's a, the episode that's coming out today with the Isabel and Meliorn was like one of the hardest mm -hmm. I ever had to do. And um, it was a, a bit, you know, weird, but it turned out steamy, beautiful. Yes, yeah, steamy, so sexy. I can't wait for you guys to see it, but it was, it was very like, you know, it was hard because the first time I was doing something like so sexy yeah. like that. Yeah. But then Isabel goes through a lot of like emotional um, states throughout the episode, so yeah, right. she does that. What about you? Uh, well, for me, Clary is kind of thrown into this world, so she's she's crying a lot. A lot. <laughs> she ends up crying a lot, not so much as she kind of not so much in novellas. Not so like much. In novellas, no. you, like if you, they ask like, you this question, you're crying every day. Right? Yeah, right. She, it's different. I mean, she becomes more of a warrior, but episode eight, there are a lot of tears in episode eight. What happened? A lot of. I eight? can't say what happened in episode eight. Oh. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Lots of tears. It was hard to shoot, but it turned out. From what I've seen, it turned out well. Um, next question. Next from, question. I think, Natalie. Natalia. Natalia. Um, what advice would you give someone aspiring to be an actress? Uh, I would say just be yourself and don't let anybody tell you no. If it's really what you love and really what you want to do, just go for it. Find plays at your school or in your community centers or just start find your opportunities. Get your friends together and do a play. Yeah, I would say um, always, you know, keep preparing for what you want to do and um, <laughs> keep preparing for what you want to do and, you know, don't, don't give up and try hard and when you work hard, you get what you want. So yeah. just work hard for what you want. Yep. All these hearts, you guys are so sweet. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, Hanya. Yeah, Hanya. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. It says, which episode are you most excited to see how the fans react to it? Because every episode is like, there's yeah. a twist in every episode. There's something crazy going on in every episode. As I've seen clips and from every episode, I, I forget about all the twists and all the surprises. Um, okay. Sorry, my little niece is here. You can't see her. Can you someone take her to the restroom? <laughs> Okay. So, um, okay. Yeah, I think it's every episode. Yeah. So I would say. What do you think? I, think I don't it's know. Every I mean, it's, it really is every episode. Episode seven or something that fans will love at the very, very end of the episode. Episode eleven. Episode eleven, 11 is like is like that emoji. Home Alone, yeah, all of like the, the, all, the whole episode. It's not at the end. It's no, no, the no, whole no. episode. It's the whole like, episode. 
Um, episode 12, though, and I keep talking about this, episode 12 is really special, and it's oh, it's something that's not only really special... Wait, I mean, sorry, I was talking about 12. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't mean to say 11. Well, 11, too. See, yeah, Malik. Um, I think that, that episode... Yeah, sorry, 12. I'm yeah. thinking... No, but episode 12, 12, so episode 12, something happens that's a little different from the books, and it's something that's very special to not only the characters, but to us as a cast, and, and to the to writers, the fans. and the fans. They're gonna and, love it. And I think for television as a whole, it's something really exciting, so... Yep. What's up, Freeform? That's right, we're That's in Freeform. Right. We're Freeform. That's what we do. <laughs> um, okay. This one. Yeah. Myara? No, Myra, but I guess it's... <laughs> Myara? Myara. I mean, I don't know. Light, 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 Light Woods. Sorry. At Light Woods. Mm -hmm. um, what's your favorite part of being in this cast? My favorite part of being in this cast is, is learning from you guys. Because I'm, I'm the baby of the cast. I'm the youngest one. And I just But love... yeah, she's the one that's done the most stuff on TV. So we actually learn from her. No. No. Um, but I love learning from you guys. Like, personally and professionally. And yeah. I don't know. You're my big sister. Aww. You know? Yeah, well, I'm an, well, we're both only childs, right? Yeah. Yeah, so I'm an only child. She's an only child. So yeah, I love the fact that, you know, we're away from our family. And, like, mm -hmm. being together. It's like we formed our own little family. Mm -hmm. And everyone gets along really good, and yeah. it's nice to have friends that are your coworkers. So I think yeah. that's the fun, the, the best part about shooting. And obviously, you guys are amazing. Right. You guys like inspire us to do better and and be better, and give you guys like what you want to see. Yeah. Yes, I have a big pimple on my cheek, but it's okay. I still love you. <laughs> You're gorgeous. What are you talking about? Um, let's see. So Janina asks, "What do you do when you're bored?" Is this on set or just in general? Well, in general, I'm a very boring person. That is not true. I think I'm, I just don't like to do, I like to stay home and like watch movies and eat. I eat a lot and no, like body. eat ice cream and I like to watch TV. You know what I watch? I don't know if I'm allowed to say this, but I watch Family Feud like on repeat. I love Family Feud. Like, there's, I think I'm the, there's like a, like a, I guess a, like a game show. And yeah. It's just always like running every day. And Do you remember that night when I came to your house and we watched like five episodes of Scandal? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, we love Scandal too. We do love Scandal. We're addicted to Scandal. Yes. Um, I don't know. What do I do? I go, to, I go work out. When I, after being a part of this cast, the guys worked so hard working out all the time. We all did. Yeah. But the guys especially got oh, really, guys into, really into, it. into it. And so, they needed a lot of work, as you can tell, right? They did it! I'm being, I'm being sarcastic! <laughs> but they were so into it. They, they looked were, great, though. They looked really They good. looked amazing, oh. and I was so proud of them. But when I got back, I was like so motivated to work out and get in shape myself. And I've been addicted to spin class lately. It's, <laughs> it's you took me with thing. you. I've been addicted to eating the great um, lately, so any, I don't think... Any time. Isabel, it's a character, if there's a second season, um, she's going to be like 300 pounds. Ta! I don't even think that's possible for you. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, okay. Andre asks, um, who on Ask Shadowhunters would you love to do a scene with that you haven't had one? Hmm. Um, we I actually didn't work with Isaiah a lot. Oh, he's so fun to work with. I would love maybe to work with him a lot or yeah. with Camille. Yeah. I didn't get a lot of scenes with her. I had a few scenes I would like to her. punch her in the face just like Clary did. It, I a felt so bad life, though. Not in real life. She's a, uh, she's a sweet person. I felt um, so bad though because Caitlin is Caitlin so is. sweet. No, Caitlin is, Lieb, who plays is. Camille Belcourt, um, is the sweetest, kindest, mm -hmm. most genuine human being. Well, oh, you guys are going to see most. her today. You're and yeah, you get today. to meet her today, which is awesome. Um, and I felt so bad punching her in the face. But well, did you really punch her in the face? No, gosh no. Gosh no. It was a trick of the cameras. And our amazing stunt coordinator, Steve Bajescu, um, made it happen. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I never got to work with um, your dad on the show, Robert Lightwood. I got to work with your mom. But your dad or your little brother, I never got to work with. Yeah, they're awesome. So good. Yeah, they they seem really nice. Today, I mean, we met in passing. Oh, you guys don't meet them till episode five, I think. Mm -hmm. Episode five is when Maris storms the Institute. Mm -hmm. Nice. What's next? Uh, let's see. Oh, already said. Oh, wait. wait. What? No, that's Andre has oh. another question. Okay. What was the most exciting thing about shooting your very first episode of Shadowhunters? It was nerve wracking. Was it, it was. for you? Oh, absolutely. It Without was very nerve wracking, and we wanted to do our best. Mm -hmm. So I think maybe we were pushing ourselves like really hard. Yeah. 
and then Madhu was so great as make uh, was so great at in making us feel very comfortable and mm -hmm. and capturing you know the characters. So I think he played a really big part in Ed and Madhu, and you know just. Yeah. Making us feel good. Yeah, it was really nice to have both of them there. And McGee, I think, was so instrumental in setting us up to kind of go on this journey and, and really have a clear vision of what the show was and what the world was and who these people were and kind of where our starting point was so that we could get to that. And end he of the is story. so passionate about Shadowhunters. Like it's he he was just really into yeah. it. He wanted to make everything better. He yeah. really just wanted to give the fans like what they want. There was actually a girl, uh, one of the wardrobe ladies, his, oh, yeah. her daughter, yeah, she's yeah, a yeah. huge fan of Shadowhunter. So he actually had her on set to like make sure that he was giving the fans what they wanted. Shout out to Elaine and Mackenzie. Yes. Um, yeah, but McGee has such passion for it. And it. Yeah, it was amazing. Love working with McGee. Um, for me, I don't know, the most, like, there were a lot of exciting things for Claire in the first episode between pandemonium and the demon attack and the running through the rain. Yes, that was real rain. Was yes, it, it was cold? cold. It was cold. <laughs> For a while, after a while, I didn't have to try to cry anymore. Because <laughs> oh, wow. I was so cold, but it just happened. But it was worth it. It was worth it. It was. I love, you know, there's a scene where you're coming into the house. I think everyone, I was reading comments and everyone mm -hmm. really connected. Even I did. I wanted to cry Aww, a little bit when I, when I saw that, um, when I saw that scene, yeah. it was really, really good. But I would not like to be wet. No, it's not fun. In, Canada where it's freezing it's so fun. props <laughs> <laughs> but your pandemonium fight was so badass oh it was like, badass Dang girl I mean not like fight in that like, it, it is badass like, fight in that dress I oh my god it. it was very it. sticky that white dress and I was sweating <laughs> everywhere I'll leave it up to the imagination but it was like sweat 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 oh my goodness okay TMI Uruguay how would you describe each other and your friendship in three words. Mm -hmm. oh, you guys make it so complicated, you know, it's Let's like, just describe our friendship in three words. Because I think I'm Annoying. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think it's like real, mm -hmm. it's fun, and it's like honest. Like, yeah. what do you think, Kat? I would say sisterly, trust, and fun. Yeah. Because it is. Yeah. There we go. Um, okay. So, uh, Allegiant or Amnesia's support asks, "What's your favorite scene that you guys have seen so far?" <sighs> that you've seen so far? I love shooting. Well, it was kind of funny shooting all the stuff in City of Bones under the bridge. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> episode two, there was um, you know City of Bones, mm -hmm. and we were out in the in, in, in the like what is it like? It was like an, an, an underpass. Yes. It was cold. And we were in really tall heels, and it was very muddy. Yes. And, and so they put plywood. There was wet grass and mud. So they're like, oh, we're going to put plywood down. And, and then they cut, and then that got wet because it was raining. Yeah, and then and they then put we on it. leaves to cover it To up. cover the plywood. And then we were just skating. There was yeah. no running. Yeah. Skating. I smacked <laughs> into the van. I think they actually used the take where um, I smacked into the van. In all it was the, running down the yeah, hill to see the, the shadows. Well, they definitely used it there. But. Yeah. Um, oh, they actually use it in the episode? I think they actually used it. Well, I don't know. I, I was slipping and falling in everyone. Who's so watching tonight? You better watch tonight. I'm watching tonight. I'm watching tonight. tonight. I'm watching, watching tonight. tonight. We're tweeting. We're live tweeting with you guys. Uh, Shadowhunters chat. Shadowhunters chat. And Shadow let's get Hunters Shadowhunters and Save Simon trending. Can we do that? Are you up for the challenge? I'm up for the challenge. Are you up for the challenge? Yeah? Yeah. I think we can do it. I think we can. I think we can. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Next question. Oh, that's a hard question. Which member of the cast is best at giving hugs? Mm. Um, I don't know. I think maybe Isaiah. Isaiah is really good at giving hugs. He's Alberto. So big, you Alberto's know. really good at giving See, hugs. See, he's so. good at giving you hugs. Well, he doesn't get the Clary side hugs. Yeah. But Isaiah's, you know, like he's tall and he's, you know, he goes mm -hmm. to works out a lot. So when he hugs you, it's like, <laughs> he's just like. I say one of Isaiah's arms is bigger than my leg. Like that's that's yeah, just the size of our, Isaiah. It's probably just bigger than our face. Oh yeah, without a doubt. He's, so yeah, he's like the you know. But I guess yeah. Simon with cat see, but no, I don't get. It. Yeah. Oh, you will. Let's oh, just wait for the oh story my God! Dogs. Yes, Let's wait for the story to continue. Yeah, you, you will. will. I forget you will. Sometimes. <laughs> um, you're next. Okay, so Chairman Meow. Hi, Chairman Meow. Wants to know how do y'all concentrate working with this. B A M F. 
Um, we can't see who it's a picture of. Oh, it's Isaiah. Of course it's Isaiah. Um, because he's so much fun. Isaiah's such a goofball. We love him. I love him to death. He became kind of like a an older brother, like a dad to me. While we Wait, were hold on. Sorry. What does B A M F mean? I, I can't say on camera. Oh, uh, there you go. Thanks, Larry. <laughs> so, um, yeah. How do we concentrate with this uh, B A M F? Um, well, he always smells he like go, Old Spice. He does, but you know, it's it's different. Like we don't. Yeah. You know. Well, you know. You know, you know the days it's hardest to concentrate with him though. When he shows up to set on a horse wrapped in a towel, that's See, just like, that. it's and like, then, come on, dude, come yeah, on. And then it's, the smell is like, woo! It's like, whoa, old spice. Oh, yeah, old spice. Then we can't concentrate. Yeah. No, it's true. <laughs> um, there you go. Oh, we did, we did that already. Yeah. Did that too. Did that one as well. Mm -hmm. We might have done all these questions. Mm. Um... So you guys, tonight's episode is so intense. I'm, it's kind of the first time you see all the shadow hunters together. You see Alec and Jace and Izzy and Clary get together and start to form the, I call it the Scooby gang. I don't know if there's another way to say it. Like the shadow hunters rescue force. Yeah, um, go, we, we have like I, it's so weird that I kind of forgot everything that happens in like episode yeah I just too. know like the most like the craziest thing to me is that Meliorn scene and I'm like mm -hmm. super nervous and I don't even want to watch it I don't want my dad <laughs> to watch like what is my dad gonna think yeah I remember the day you shot that scene because it was a closed set and we were all on set like getting ready for the rest of the day we just wanted to all we wanted to do was go watch and see because we were so excited for you but you know it was a closed set so we are all waiting in anticipation yeah so now everyone's gonna see it and I'm just like it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. I'm sure. No, of I, I'm sure of it. Um, do you guys, uh, uh, do you guys okay. have questions for us? <laughs> okay. okay. Um, let's see. <laughs> okay. Hi, Jordan. So, okay. Let's see. What else happens in the episode tonight? Um, oh, you meet three of our favorite down rollers. I put out a tweet about this last night because oh. I'm so excited. Tonight, you guys get to meet Camille Delcourt. You get to meet Rafael oh, yeah. Santiago and. Meliorn. Meliorn, played by three of, of my favorite actors who came onto the show. Yes. Uh, Caitlin Lieb, David Castro, and, and Jay Jade Hassan. 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 He has a beautiful, Hassan. beautiful Hassan. last name, and Hassan. I don't know how to pronounce it. But um, they all bring such life to these characters, and they're so. They just add magic to the show, and they're down holders, so that's what they're supposed to do, but it's amazing. Mm -hmm. The best thing about Clary and Isabel is that we're badass, strong, confident women, right? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, lightly. Yeah, um, yeah, I think that it's nice to have strong women on TV so mm -hmm. girls, you know, could look up to these, you know, strong characters yeah. and, and, you know, want to strive to be more like them, you know, positive and the people. Well, and what's so great about Clary and Izzy is that they're never pitted against each other. You know, so often you see two strong women who are in a situation and they get pitted against each other and they get put in competition and then there's that cattiness, but that doesn't happen on our show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that's great. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's really important for television. Oh, we have more questions from Zutwita. Uh, I'm just seeing if there's anything else you know, there. Oh. Have you read the books? I've read the books. And I, I read the first book. Such a I'm a huge fan. Cassandra Clare is amazing. Reading book six, world. I almost had to stop because it got so oh, dark. What's your favorite? It's your favorite. Okay, let's see. What can you say about Matthew Daddario? That's a Mad Hatter one. Mr. Know. How do you have him, Mr. Godfather? Godfather. The God. We call him Godfather yeah. or Grandfather. What? We call him both because we love him so much. Grandfather. But he's yeah. the Godfather. So basically, he is like watches over us. He does. He watches over us. Mm -hmm. He always has connections. He's the king of Google. The king of Yelp. Yeah, so if you want it to go to like a good restaurant or if you want to know about something very important, he probably knows about everything. He's got the hookup. Yeah. And he's one of the most interesting people to have a conversation with, mm -hmm. I think, because he always has an opinion mm -hmm. and it's always a very intelligent mm -hmm. one. And I don't know, I always I always ask him things. Mm -hmm. I and just, he's, you know, extremely good looking, so. And he plays well, that too. Brother, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, I won't go, I won't, anyway. Um... What's your favorite part about the new season? Brianna Clark. Um, 
I just, I can't, like, I love everything I so much. It's just, um, I like, I guess, I like uh, the relationship between Isabel and her mom. I think it's kind yeah, of cool. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. It's, you know, different, a little bit different from the books. What I'm excited to there. see, yeah, what I'm excited to see is uh, as these episodes progress, right now we're still kind of setting up the world and we're yeah. still kind of setting up the story, the main story that yeah. kind of carries us through the season. But as the episodes continue, the relationships start to really come to the forefront. And that's the, not only the romantic relationships, but the familial relationships and the different mm -hmm. political relationships. They all kind of start to, it becomes more about the humanity than the fantasy or the danger or whatever it is of the story. And I think that's what's so special about Shadowhunters. Mm -hmm. Like the end of episode five, I saw a lot of it because I had a lot of um, ADR to do for it. Oh. The, that's when you revoice the sound to make it perfect for the show. Um, I had a lot of ADR for it, and I just remember watching it. It's kind of the first time where all of the relationships come crashing together, and it's it's fascinating. I can't wait for you guys to see it. Um. <laughs> uh, let's see. <laughs> Who played the most pranks during filming? Uh, Dominic Sherwood. Is there any question? So, oh. um, Marina, or... Marina, yeah. Marina. Um, what was your favorite subject at school? My favorite subject, and I was very good at it, was math. <gasps> me Believe too. Not, really? Yeah. Don't ask me any questions right now because I, 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 I forgot. But I was very good at math. I was always taking like AP classes in math, and I even like, I think took several courses like over the summer, and I yeah. passed a lot of like classes without taking them. So math nerds. Yeah. That's us. Geniuses. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I'm really excited because my school just started up again this week. You're starting school? Yeah. Well, my, my new semester just started yesterday, so I've been diving into applied economics, and I'm really happy about it. I'm just... I'm such a nerd. I'm yeah. sorry. Okay. Um, Bryson, that's a cool name, wants to know, what's been the highlight of being able to film Shadowhunters? Do you want to start, or do you want me to? To me, the highlight of filming Shadowhunters is, is like, my first big, we can call it, like, first big role or mm -hmm. first big show or yeah. to me it's like a dream come true I'm from a really small town in Texas and to be doing the show with so much love and so much support from fans mm -hmm. it's like you I think you hardly get that in a show usually mm -hmm. they're new and up and coming and right. then this show has a big following and so many supporters and to me like that's the highlight of being in a small town dreaming to have a small part in any movie, any TV show, than yeah. to book, you know, one of the leads on a amazing show. Yeah. That's to me the highlight. To me, it's it's kind of the same thing, you know, to be able to bring to life these characters that so many people love and so many people look up to and so many people have an attachment to. It's really something that, you know, is special to me, and and I think it's nice to have that support and that excitement from other people as well. Because you know we poured our heart and our soul into the show, and to have people give us some of that love back, it's it's really an amazing experience. So thank you guys for all the love and support for the show. We love you guys. Let's see. Um, if you had to play a male shadow hunter character, ooh. That'd be fun. That'd be fun to play. That'd be Valentine. really fun. But a little bit of um, Alan has to stay in the like, like has yeah, to, like, of come course. to me because it's just like he's so good. Alan is on another level with that character. He's amazing. Um, and also, yeah, it, it, <laughs> Alan's amazing. Um, I, I don't know. It's a toss up to me between Magnus and Alec. But Magnus is not a shadow hunter. Oh, that's true. Okay, well then I'd have to say Alec if it has to be a shadow hunter. Because I just, I love the, the conflict that his character has and kind of the journey of self-discovery. And also, I love archery. So the whole bow and arrow aspect of it is very... There should be a shadow hunter that rides horses. Well, that would just be Isaiah. But, well, I guess, whatever. <laughs> that never gets old. I want to ride horses. All I right. do too, we should go. Do you want to go? Ride Let's horses? Yes. Not now, obviously, because we're chatting with the, yeah. the angels out there. But... Hmm. Um, what other relationships going to start coming in? Soon. Soon, soon, soon. Even perhaps in a few hours. Yeah. Five minutes? Okay, five minute warning, guys. All right. Would you like to come to Brazil? Please come. Yes. Of course. I'd love to Brazil. Brazil. Mm -hmm. Which chat? Oh, sorry. Come on. 
which chapter are you most excited for us to see? Twelve, um, I think. Whatever. I mean, twelve is twelve is great, but all of them. Yeah, they're all amazing. Really they're all amazing. Have but new. every time I see the photos and I look back, oh my on god, it, yes. What? You guys are crazy. You find all the photos. Thank you so much Thank for you. sending them to us because because we love you for sending us photos and sometimes, you know, yes. Yeah, so little behind. You guys find things that we haven't even yeah. seen yet. So you so guys are amazing. you are our source for news and new mm -hmm. behind the scenes peeks. Um, we answered that already. We answered that. Let's see. What else can we say? Oh, there's new questions on the top. Are there new questions yeah. on the top? What's your favorite word in Spanish? My favorite word in Spanish is amor, love. That's like my favorite word. It's so strong and powerful. You know, love, it just doesn't mean like between a boy and a girl, but like a, a relationship, like between like love, like, um, but like mother and a daughter and, and you know, your father and your grandma. I think love in general is yeah. so beautiful. So to me, amor, I don't know. What about, do you even know Spanish, Karen? I took Spanish a long time ago when I was a little kid. Say something and I forgot in most of it. I can't add that's how much I don't know. I can count to 20. Go. I can, oh, gosh, no. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if I know it that well. Um, I was like five years old when I was learning Spanish. I want to okay, say, language, say, um, otorrino laringologo. Otorrino, otorrino, laringologo. Larin, larin, goli. <laughs> that was what I was saying. <laughs> what am I saying? Otorrino, otorrino, laringologo. Larin Goroko. Goro. Goro. It uh, means a doctor it? from ears, nose, and, and ears, <laughs> nose, and throat. Ears, nose, and throat. There you go. I can say that now in Spanish. Um, uh, what is the first thing that comes to mind when you think of each other? Okay. When the first thing that comes to mind when I think about Kat, I just think like, She's so cute. <laughs> I think sister. Oh, you that think comes sister? That's what comes to my mind. Oh, I just think like, oh, cat. Like, I that's mean, what other than mind. like gorgeous, amazing, oh. fierce, sexy woman when I think of you. Hello. That's the other thing. Look at you. Spicy red hair. Um, oh, that's an odd thing. Ooh. Okay, wait, wait. Jocelyn Garraway wants to know, what is your favorite part of being heroines to young girls? I think it's a really exciting time to be a young woman in television, mm -hmm. simply because there are so many strong female heroines that are our leads of shows and our prominent characters in shows and films out there right now, that it, it's, it's really exciting to be kind of up and coming in this era because we have such an opportunity to not only play these roles now, but then to move forward into other roles and kind of carry this with us. And mm -hmm. it's, it's a new, refreshing take on, you know, what, roles women can take on in these projects, and I think it's really exciting. Yeah, I think it's a, a huge responsibility, you know, yeah. to be positive and to say the right things. I think we have a really nice platform that, you know, we have more people like viewing us and mm -hmm. seeing us, and they kind of listen to us, so I think yeah. it's very important to just send out the positive, be yeah. real, and, just, you know, let people know it's not about everything physical, right. that it's yeah. from the heart. Well, not only in our characters, but also in who yeah, we are. Yeah, like who yeah. we are as, as a person. Yeah. But thank you so much, guys. It is time guys, to go. It is time to say adios, sayonara, goodbye. I wonder so if my mom's farewell. watching. My mom's a big fan of Periscope. I think my mom's so watching. I hope my, my mom's <laughs> watching, my mom mommy. My mom's too. The mom's the best. So I'm not even going to say things she watches on Periscope because she is a little too intense. But I love you, mom. I love you too, mommy. Anyways, bye, guys. Thank you bye. so much. Watch tonight, Shadow Hunters at uh, uh, 9 8 Central. 9 8 Central on Freeform. Freeform. Yeah! Woo, 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 woo. To the free form. To the free form.